Dr. Clayton Holdren, head of the bioscience division. I yeah, I have monkey. You to see the work we're doing. It's I like you. Amazing. Yeah, monkey. Monkey. Hello? Hello? That place is pretty empty. Hello? Hi? I wondered if you might make it here. You're quite resourceful. I've known his father. The Institute. Hi, father. I know why you're here. I'd like to discuss things with you face to face. Okay. Please, step into the elevator. Uh, give me a second. Okay, I can't access that one. Well, okay. I can only imagine what you've heard. What you think of us. Well, nothing good to be honest, so... I'd like to show you that you may have the wrong impression. Uh, I'm not be that sure, to Welcome be honest. Welcome to the Institute. Yeah, hi. This is the reality of the Institute. This place, these people, the work we do. For over a hundred years, we've dedicated ourselves to humanity's survival. Mm -hmm. Decades of research, countless experiments and trials, a shared vision of how science can help shape the future. I have only one plan, it to be honest, my boy. Easy. And our actions are often misinterpreted by those above ground. Sorry, Mr. The President, you Some took my kid. We can show them what we've accomplished. And then you tried to now, kill me with other guys? We must remain underground. There's too much at stake here. To risk it all. <laughs> As you see, things above are unstable. Uh. I'd like to talk to you about what we can do for everyone. What the fuck, the elevator? But that can wait. You are here for a specific, very personal reason. Yeah. You are here for your son. Yeah, exactly. Oh! Matey Moo! Eh. Is that even my kid? Where can I go? Don't have the key. I'm in the wrong place. Eh. Jammed. Eh. What do you want me to do? Kido! You okay there? Sean? Huh? Oh. Yes, I'm Sean. Uh, <laughs> Sean. Oh my God, it's really you. Who are you, Daddy? <laughs> uh, yeah. Sean, it's me. I'm Papa. I'm your dad. Father, what's going on? What's happening? Uh, we're leaving. We're leaving this place together. Yeah. Okay, Sean. What's going on, Father? It will be okay. Shh, Let's just see what we can. Okay, Sean. Yeah, I'm here now. I don't know you. Go away, Father. Father, help me. There's someone here. Help me. <sighs> Sean, please calm down. I'll get You're you out of there. You're stupid. Father, Father, help me. He's trying to take me. Father, Father, help me. Your father? We need to talk, Sean. S923 recall code Cirrus. Fascinating, but disappointing. The child's responses were not at all what I anticipated. He's a prototype, you understand. What? We're only just now beginning to explore the effects of extreme emotional stimuli. Where's my kid then? Please try and keep an open mind. Is that him or that's the sense? Is that you are emotional? And that your journey here has been fraught with challenges. So you gonna get emotional slap in your stupid face? I am father. Well, and that's my fucking hand. Yeah. Let's be just first of, yeah. Give me Sean, the real Sean. Yeah. Right now. I know. I know. Now you didn't know. You've gone to such lengths to find him. 
I'll make this very simple. Where is my son? Yeah. He's here. In the Institute. <sighs> Closer than you think. No shit, but Sherlock. I need you to realize that this situation is far more Get complicated the hands. than you could have imagined. You have traveled very far and suffered a great deal to find your son. Well, your tenacity and dedication have been real. It's good to finally meet you. Fucking hell, speed up your speech. It's me. I am Sean. I am. What? Your son. What? Okay, let's just say. How, How is that even possible? I know this is a lot to take in. In the vault, you had no concept of the passage of time. You were released from your pod and went searching for the sun. Huh. You'd lost. But then you learned that your son was no longer an infant, but a ten year old boy. You believed that ten years had passed. Is it really so hard to accept that it was not ten, but sixty years? Ooh. That is the reality. And here I am. Ooh. Raised by the Institute. Ooh. And now it's later. Ooh. Ooh. Mm. But why? But why? Yeah. Why take a child? Why take you? Ah, now that's the question. This. Sean? Why me? At that time, the year 2227, the Institute had made great strides in synth production. But it was never enough. That doesn't add up all those things. And the all goal those of things. perfection drove them ever onward. The what other guy I killed, he was thinking like he was taking care of you. So they followed the best rolled. example thus far. He's not the human being. <sighs> walking, talking, fully articulate capable of anything yeah yeah <sighs> human synths really human like synths a great distinction the Institute endeavored to create synthetic organics the most logical starting point of course was human DNA plenty of that was available of course how had all become corrupted in this wasteland Radiation affected everyone. Even yeah. their attempts to shield themselves from the world above. Members of the Institute have been exposed. Another source was necessary. Well, there's nothing against the Synth, Institute but me. the Institute is fucked After up, so... Discovering records from Vault Sean, one, we're going home and you're gonna get... You're gonna get grounded for that? You did a lot of body things, you know? Sean, now I'm talking. Into every other Sean? Human cell in the commonwealth i was exactly Sean? what they needed and so it was my dna that became the basis of the synthetic organics used to create every human-like synth you see today i am their father uh. through science we are family the synths me and you and you you've been down here the whole time i have yes I know you must have questions. Please. Anything I can do to help you understand. Her mother. She never got to see you grow up? Yes. What happened to her was... I've gone over the records of the incident, of course. Yeah. It seems her death was an unfortunate bit of collateral damage. N no! Collateral damage? She was murdered. Yeah. Killed? Yes. Murdered. Yes. I'm not so sure about that. You're fucking stupid Still, for your age. I do regret never having known her. For many years, I never questioned who you my knew her, were. but you were like. I accepted my situation, and that was that. With old age comes regret, and asking what if more often. You know what? You're just stupid. What matters now is that you, you and think I you're like, oh yeah, I'm smart boy, I'm big smart again. boy. But what you're else fucking can I say stupid, Sean. To ease your mind. Yes, I don't want to talk with you. I think I've heard stupid. enough. Stupid. Very well. 
The Institute is on the verge of some important breakthroughs. Your presence would be appreciated as we approach them. Okay. I've been a part of something amazing here. I've helped to build a life for myself and the people of the Institute. Hey, they're gonna destroy it! And now, after all these years, chico, you chico. have an opportunity to help with that. Take Doesn't those that hands off me. Isn't that what you want? No. I won't be a part of this. I can't. Why? Because of the reputation of the Institute. Uh, yeah, the pretty Institute much. The Institute can provide a better life than anything above Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. You've been because he says I knew so smart. You've seen what it's like. I assure you that you are better off with us. <sighs> I don't know what to do. I realize that. It's why I'm trying to help you. Okay, I hope that go. you can see that rationally. The Institute is Sean, the only thing left in the world. Move your ass. Okay. Go. I'll be I just behind you. That you give the Institute me and I gotta try not to kill chance. you. But I can't a try. To show you I can't what promise I've been telling you. Oh. We really do have humanity's best interest at heart. Will you take that chance? Let's go. No. I'm sorry. I can't do that. I'm sorry to hear that. I had certainly hoped we could work together. But every man must make his own decisions. Yeah. If you choose to leave, I cannot force you to stay. Understand, though, that I cannot allow you to remain within the Institute. You may have safe passage back to the Relay, where you will be sent back to the surface. But from that point, you must be considered hostile. I am sorry. I must think first of the safety of the Institute. Eh? And in the cruel world that has developed, those who are not with us are against us. The Elevator will return you to the Relay. Fuck off, I'm going with you. <laughs> dooby 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 dooby. Sean! Where are all the goodies? Oh. I got a password. Why oh, you have so many cameras here? So it's nothing here? I wanna check something. Whoops. You are hiding because you fear no way death. to pick this. No, I'm not fearing anything. I just killed the uh, cyborg. I don't think it's my son, so. Scanning. Where are you? Should I kill him or no? Doopy doopy doopy. Hey guys! <laughs> I wanna still fight them. Can I go back down? I have a password, I think, now, so. Broken. Stupid, 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 stupid. But you know what? Maybe not gonna be killing him. Yeah. Let's not kill him, but still kill the soldiers if they're there. Sean, can we talk about this? Have you reconsidered your decision? Sean, isn't there some other option? Some other way we can work things out? You've seen the Commonwealth. You must have some idea of how this world works. You're either with us or you're not. I'm afraid it's that simple. Okay, never mind. Forget it. Never mind. I s I'm gonna just kill all your friends now. You're gonna see, you're gonna regret that. You're gonna kill those sins if they are here. You're gonna be unhappy about it. I know that. Why oh, they're not here? Sins! Anyone? Maybe I should work with him and then just... 
everyone. Let's see what they gotta tell me now. Network scanner holotape. Okay, it did something. So... Oh! Where am I? Well, I'm here. Okay. So we're gonna report now that cell. Okay, okay. Yeah, he's not gonna be happy. Yo! has informed me that the Institute's on high alert, and you're to blame. Explain yourself, Knight. The Institute is the enemy. I was simply doing my duty. Your duty yeah. is to follow my orders to the letter, Knight. Your instructions were clear. You were to infiltrate the Institute, find Dr. Lee, and convince her to return to the Brotherhood. <sighs> I'm extremely disappointed in you, Knight. Oh, fuck off! You fucking wanker! Fuck off! You all think you are better than me? I need some covering fire no. over here. Oops. Eh. Keep their heads down. Fuck off, all of you! I was nice all the time. Do you like telling me like I disappointed all of you? I'm not gonna be dealing with that. Yeah, I disappointed you now, eh? Fuck you. Disappointment. And tell me what's disappointing. Yes, be nice to me. And now I'm gonna go back in time and do the things the way you want me to. Yeah. Rude. Okay, yeah, I need to go with you, so... Sean, can we talk about this? Have you reconsidered Yeah, decision? let's go. Let's do that. I've changed my mind. I'll work with you. Well, that's good to hear. All right, then. The Institute is now your home, as much as it is mine. Mm -hmm. Please take some time, get to know it. Meet the people you'll be working with. You'll want to introduce yourself to the Division Heads. Dr. Fillmore in Facilities. Dr. Ao in SRB. Mm -hmm. Dr. Holdren in Bioscience. And finally, Dr. Lee in Advanced Systems. Ah, Lee! They've all been notified of your arrival, of course. I need to go to Dr. Lee. And then we'll discuss what comes next. Okay. Can I? Oh man. I can go everywhere now. Hi. Hi. <laughs> you gonna be just talking to everyone here? Hi. Excuse me, doctor. I don't know. You really are here. Well, all right. I'm Ellie. What are you doing? Ali Fillmore. You can think of me as the Institute's chief engineer. When Father told us about you, I could yeah, yeah. believe it. You've been through so much, I think most people would have just given up. If you don't mind my asking, what was it that kept you going all that time? Let's... I guess yeah. I just wasn't ready to die yet. Oh, that's understandable. The will to survive is the most basic human instinct. Now, 
I'll give you a quick rundown of the facilities division, and then I'll answer any questions you might have after. I don't have any questions. As you might guess, we keep the Institute's mechanical and electrical systems running smoothly. Ugh. We maintain and upgrade all of the systems that make it possible to live and work in a place like this. <laughs> There's a lot of machinery behind these walls that recycles the air and water and provides mm -hmm. power to the laboratories and quarters. The work we do might not be as exciting as some of the other departments, but it's at least as important. So, now that you're here Ooh. and you've spoken to Father, does that mean you're on board? He, what? He, he. Absolutely. Yep. Oh, good to hear. It'll be a load off Sean's mind. Take your time. Get yourself acquainted. There's a lot to take in. Plenty of things you won't find topside. If there's okay. anything else you'd like to know about the facilities division, I'm happy to discuss it. I'm happy not to ask you. I'm good for now. Thanks. Goodbye then. Bye. I'm looking forward to working with you. Advanced systems. This is over here, the Dr. Lee lady. What is she even testing? Nothing. Yo! Point, Dr. Lee. Oh, it's you. You're not authorized to be here. I am authorized. Actually, I was looking for you. Me? Why? I've been sent by the Brotherhood of Steel hey. to find you. You don't see. beat around the bush, I'll give you that. Yeah. I knew it was just a matter of time before your people would track me down. I've been looking over my shoulder for almost a decade, waiting for them to send someone like you to kill me. Not kill! I'm only here with good intentions. You have my word. You're giving me your word? Even though we just met? Yeah. Hmm. Since Father trusts you, I'm going to give you the benefit of the doubt. I might not agree with everything he says, but I know he'd never allow harm to come my way. Say what you came here to say, and then leave me alone. Okay. The Brotherhood needs your help, Doctor. Needs my help? Yep. Why? They seem to have everything under control when I left. The Brotherhood valued your cool, presence, <laughs> and we'd like you to come back. Well, how sweet of them. Tell come on. me something. Why would I possibly want to come crawling back to the Brotherhood? What reason would I have to throw away everything I've accomplished here? Cool armors and uh, cool stuff. Uh. Father trusts me, and so should you. You're wasting your breath. I'm a Fuck. scientist, not a soldier. The Brotherhood desired my creations in order to destroy, to take control. I'm mm. not interested in returning to that way of life. It's not like that. Uh. I give up. What would it take to convince you? All right, uh. I'll play your game. I had a colleague down here. A Dr. Virgil. Several months ago, there was an accident in his lab, and he was killed. I uh. wanted to help with the investigation, but Father had the laboratory sealed, saying that it was contaminated. The incident Fair. never sat right with me. The more I asked about it, the more Virgil I thought is not Father dead. was deflecting my questions. If you bring me solid information on what killed him, I'll take it as a favor from the Brotherhood. And Virgil is not dead. Do we have a deal? I know this may come as a shock. Yeah. Dr. Virgil is still alive. I met him myself. Oh, please. Do you really think a cheap tactic like that is going to work on someone like me? Stop trying to avoid the legwork by lying. Either you get me the evidence or we have nothing else to talk about. Deal? Deal. Yeah. All right. Dr. Virgil's lab was in the biosciences division. I can give you a code that will get you into the section. Okay. The lab itself has been sealed, so you'll have to breach it on your own. I'd tell you to be quiet about it, but your brotherhood and discretion isn't exactly your strong suit. <laughs> yeah, to and be this, yeah. <laughs> if you get caught, <sighs> we never had this conversation. Now, for the sake of keeping up appearances, let me see that pit boy of yours. I've been told to install Very a coarser chip in it for you. No. Father's orders. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're to be given full access, with the ability to relay yeah. in and out of the institute okay. at will. That sounds cool. Thank you. Thank you. I'm sure that'll come in handy. Given that the relay is the only way to access the Institute, handy is something of an understatement. In case the significance is lost on you, you'll be the only one here with that kind of access. <laughs> if nothing else, it should demonstrate the amount of trust Father has placed in you. Speaking of, I trust our discussion will remain between the two of us. Yeah, yeah, don't worry about now, it. I need to get back to work, and I'm sure you have other things to do. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so... To go this way. Wanna fight? First, I wanna do that one. That's the place I wanna go. It's 
Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. I need to find the Virgil thing to heal him as well. I don't remember what he told me that he put the thing. Yes. Ooh. Team punk. Maybe girls? Ah, not important. Got it. <laughs> nice and easy. Oh no. Whoa, 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 whoa. Could you calm down? Oh no. I'm gonna be taking that. Okay. Oh! Oh no! What the fuck is going on here? By the way, do you have any grenades? Oh, I have molotovs. Hello? I hear someone over there. Okay. Open. There we go. Hello. Perimeter movement Who the fuck are you? Eh. Eh. Mr. Fister. Oof. Big boy! <laughs> I don't need the paint, I'm not gonna be drinking paint. Oh, Kitty! Hello? That's a synth, Kitty? Oh no. Ugh! Fuck all with that shit in! How many more of you? Fuck. Calm down. Yeah. Did he didn't want me to go this way? Ugh. You're not nice guys. Okay, let's go. Another terminal. Okay. <laughs> it's gonna take a second. Maybe mass. What? That was really awful. <laughs> Like this zero three times. Okay. Okay. What the? Are there mutants here? Wait. I didn't know. If he won't see reason, then I have to take matters into my own hands. What we're doing, it's not right. It needs to stop. If anyone should find this after, after I'm gone. Oh, a monkey! I know that I never wanted to hurt monkey. Anyone. anyone. Do you understand me? You're here. I'm gonna make sure the whole program monkey. is Monkey. If not for good, then... He. <laughs> Monkey. Don't leave. Yeah, you have a plan Not to become a mutant. Uh, Yo. Excuse me, Dr. Lee? It took you long enough to find that evidence. Let me see what you've got. Well, fuck off. Here you go. A holotape. This better not be a waste of my time. He's alive. Yeah, yeah. You're not listening. 
They yeah. lied to me. Yeah. They lied to me, and I didn't even realize how far it went. And they know where he All is. Years of loyalty for nothing. No matter how badly it hurts, yep. you needed to hear the truth. And for that, I thank you. I so, came to the Institute to get away from the Brotherhood, yeah. from the whole world. I just wanted to do my research in peace. Father took me in and gave me access Yo, to cutting edge technology that I only dreamed existed. <laughs> I became jaded. I thought that the Institute cared, that they wanted to better mankind. Yeah, okay, but I don't care what you have to say. Go back to Brotherhood or to Virgil. Bobo is gonna be happy. You're working for, then it's all pointless. If they lied about Doctor Virgil, who knows what else they've been lying about? Probably a lot of things. what their plans are for my work. I'll make my way back to the Brotherhood, but I'm going to have to do it on my own. I can't take any chances being seen with you. Okay. Tell whoever sent you yeah. that they've just regained the services of Doctor Madison Lee. Ha <laughs> ha! Thank you. You're the best, Lee. Okay, now we're gonna do the with other thing. I hope you and father yeah, 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 I hope the same. Blah blah blah. Nobody cares. I gotta be fucking you over, father. That's my son. I don't even know if you are my son for real. I do need to go here. Oh yeah, that's the thing that father told me to do. Sean. Stop calling him father, by the way. That's Sean. Yo. Gonna have to work pretty hard Hi, Doc. To anyone down here. Welcome. So good to have you here, Doctor Clayton Holdren. Head of the bioscience division. I yeah, I have monkey. You to see the work we're doing. I like you. Amazing. Yeah, monkey. Monkey. Now what? Okay, you're not. I'm sure it's fascinating, but that's not why I'm here. <laughs> monkey. Of course, I completely understand. Before you go, at least let me give you a brief overview of what we do here. Okay. I promise I'll keep it short. As the name implies, the bioscience division specializes in fields of study such as botany, genetics, and medicine. Our monkey. most important directive is to ensure the health and well-being of everyone in the Institute. Of monkey. To that end, we cultivate highly specialized breeds of flora for use in food and medicine. We've even started to explore the idea of synthetic animal life. You probably saw the gorillas. They're really just a pet project yeah. at this point, but the potential is exciting nonetheless. Monkey. That's amazing. Seems like there's nothing you guys can't do. With hard work and ingenuity? Any challenge can be overcome. Hey, I'm yeah. sure I've taken up enough of your time as it is. I like I you. Have to ask, have you decided whether you'll join us? I think gonna be nice. I'm not you. sure how well I'll fit in, but I'd like to give it a try. Great. I was hoping you'd say that. In any case, I imagine you'll want to continue looking around. Or if you prefer, I'd be happy to answer any questions you might have. No worries. Uh, I'm good. I'm for good now. for now. Thanks. Take care then. It's gonna have a wee last look on monkeys. Monkey! 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 Big monkey! 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 monkey. Oh yeah, yo, yo, yo. Okay. Yeah, yeah the, the, the other director Holdren. Gorillas are cool. So weird to even think about gorillas, they're like, you know, they're like OP, they're like the same size as us, they may be he they heavier than us, but like muscles, pure muscles. Hi. Hi. Move your ass, I'm gonna kill you. Thank you. Hi. Hey, Doc. Now I'm talking, not you. Here you are. Justin Ayo, acting director of the Synth Retention Bureau. I'll mm -hmm. be up front with you. What the We're fuck? going to be keeping a close eye on you for the near future. Despite oh. your relation to father, oh. you're a bit of an unknown quantity. I'm sure you understand. There won't be any issues, will there? <sighs> Why? Don't you trust me? I'll be honest. You're an outsider. <laughs> the first outsider to be allowed access to the Institute in quite a long time. So? In fact. There's little precedent for this situation, so... It's only natural to take extra precautions, hmm? It's nothing personal, I assure you. Now, Father has asked that I provide you with a brief overview of yeah, the synth yeah. retention here. Our primary responsibility chop, chop. is the recovery of escaped synths that are hiding among the human population on the surface. Let them if go. If the synths want to be free, yeah. you should let them. Synths do not want. 
They might look like human beings, but they're machines. No. As to why they're escaping? That matter is currently under investigation. I have one Our good friend, is the Corsair, and he's a synth. Third generation synth assigned to operate on the surface. Corsairs hunt down and reclaim Ooh. synths that have escaped the institute. Heard those they are highly uh, self-sufficient, trained in combat, infiltration, and tracking. In a word, our Corsairs are relentless. But I gather you know all this, since you've encountered one already. In fact, they're a pretty weak. I'd very much like to know how you defeated it. <laughs> Poof! That's all. <laughs> yeah, it was useless. I hate to break it to you, but your Corsair wasn't all that tough. Hmm. Then it's likely the unit was defective. It's rare, but Defective. faults can occur from time to time. I suppose I'll have to ask robotics to perform I'm a detailed diagnosis. I'm just the best. The I'm the best of them all. And you're stupid. Boop. Now, unless you need something else, I'll get back to work. And I'm, I'm good, good for now. Thanks. Very well. See ya. Well, that's over here. What are those? It's more serious. What the hell is that? <laughs> the new for fuck's sake. <laughs> Oh, I'm big about sin, yeah? Carry on, sir. Or what? You guys go with that quest. I don't care about the quest with those guys. I need to tell the Brotherhood that I succeed. And them to be nice to me because they were not nice to me last time. Elevator. Oh. Yeah. Up, please. This thing. Mm. Oh, I can just tell from my own, I think. Hey, oh. whoa, my head is feeling funny. Dog meat. Dog meat. Yeah! Now you're gonna be coming with me all the time. <laughs> Here's your holotape, Proctor. Hope the data on that thing was worth it. Thanks. You know, it's good to see you're still in one piece. Thank you. I wasn't you. sure what the interceptor would do to you. I'm not here for small talk. Suit yeah. yourself. Yee <laughs> doggy. In the meantime, your mission I miss to you. Dr. Lee still needs to be completed. I believe Elder Maxon gave you all of the details. Yeah, yeah, I don't worry about it. Now I can go to him and tell him the good news. That she's gonna be back. I hope he's gonna be happy about it. Hey Timu! How can a machine believe it's all? Yeah, let's tell him about that. E. Yo! E. I received word that Dr. Lee is returning to us. Yeah. How cooperative do you think she'll be? I've convinced her that the Institute is the enemy, not the Brotherhood. Well done, Knight. As soon as Dr. Lee arrives. We'll interrogate her aboard the Pridwin. She's been under the Institute's influence for the last decade. Mm -hmm. And we can't afford to take any chances. But don't harm her, or I'm gonna kill you all. Thanks to the success of your reconnaissance efforts, it's time to advance our operations to the next phase. I want you to report to Proctor Ingram at the airport. She has a special project that requires your immediate attention. Once again, Knight, you don't fail to impress. I know. Dismissed. <clears throat> I'm pretty cool. Well... First thing I get nice to rest, you know. It was a long day for me. I don't know if you noticed, but I did everything when you were doing nothing. Control systems all reporting back nominal. So yeah, I do that later. Delta huh. sequence initiated.